Now that you have WhatsApp installed on your device and you've signed up for an account, you're ready to get started using the app. Not too sure how? Don't worry, we'll show you the ropes. I'm Jessica from techboomers.com. In this video, I'll show you how to use WhatsApp. Note that this video will show WhatsApp running on an iPhone, but it shouldn't be much different on an Android. Now, let's get started. The first thing you'll want to do when you start using WhatsApp is to add contacts. To do so, open up WhatsApp on your device. Tap the Chats button at the bottom of your screen. Then, tap this button in the top right. Tap New Contact to add someone. Enter their name and contact information. Then, tap Done. To send a message on WhatsApp, tap Chats on the bottom menu. Then, select the contact you want to send a message to. This will open up a chat window. You can type in a message in the text box that appears above your keyboard. Tap the blue button on the right to send it. Tap the plus sign button on the left to attach pictures, videos, documents, and more. Tap the camera button to snap a picture to send. Or tap the microphone button to record an audio message. If you want to block someone on WhatsApp, open up your chat with that person, then tap their name where it appears at the top of your screen. Scroll down to the bottom, then tap Block This Contact. To change your WhatsApp status, tap the Status button in the bottom left corner. Then tap My Status. This will open a window where you can capture a photo or video to show your contacts what you're up to. Tap the circle button at the bottom to take a photo, or hold it down to capture a video. Tap the text box to enter a caption if you want to. Then tap the blue button to post it. That's it for our tutorial on how to use WhatsApp. To learn more, check out our free WhatsApp course on techboomers.com. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you click the thumbs up button below. Check out techboomers.com for over 100 free courses on all of today's most popular websites and apps.